like The Daily Show if Jon Stewart was a girl and it was uh, three minutes a day and online with zero budget. So it's actually, uh, now that I've said that, it's really not like The Daily Show at all. <laughs> but it's cool, and it's rocketboom.com. Joining me now is Amanda Cogden, the host of Rocket Boom. Amanda, thank you for joining us. Thank you, Kevin. Uh, sorry about the map earlier. Oh, you know, what am I uh, going to do? My bad. I tend to yeah. ruin things around these parts. Uh, first of all, i got to say big congratulations. Steve Jobs calling you guys out. Yeah, that was, wow, that was great. It was, it was really cool to see, you know, only... Two video uh, video podcasts. I hate that. I hate that phrase. I mean, video do you blog. Hate the... Yeah, it's not a video podcast. It's a video blog. Is but, it? Um, would you? Do you? Are you, a, are you considered a vlogger? Do you have a, a vlogger? Blog? I do have a. I have a personal vlog, and then a Rocket Boom is a. You know, the non-personal blog. Right. Vlog. Um, but yeah, it, it was great seeing him there, seeing us up there with Tiki Bar, which is also a really fun show. And, Did you uh, have any idea that that was going to happen? No was idea. Surprise? No idea. There was all these rumors about the video, video, you know, this new video iPod. It's coming out, and then, and when it finally did to see us up there, it was just, you know, wow, here we are. Sweet. Yeah. And and buckets of, of cash from Steve Jobs. Oh, tons. And now it's yeah, like, he's just you know. He sending... delivered the Bentley personally. I, exactly. I heard. Exactly. Yeah, sending just cash in the mail. Great. Well, that's what he does. <laughs> you know, just throw money at it. It'll be fine. Uh, even if you kill somebody. Uh, how big is is Rocket Boom now, though? Because I know you've been at this for a while, haven't you? Yeah, we will. We're coming up on our first anniversary, which will be on the twenty sixth. Happy so, birthday! Thank you. And um, yeah, we have about. I think that we can track 70,000 downloads a day. Wow, that's incredible. Yeah, so for just, you know, being kind of a baby, not even hitting that one-year mark, it's really excellent. So I know, I know Steve is sending you bucks of cash, but it's, it's a little-known <laughs> fact that you guys are owned by, like, a giant corporation. And oh, yeah. You're in the same studio as The Daily Show. I know we joke about it, but you're staff of 400, mm -hmm. correct? Right, Four, 450, actually. Wow, yeah. you guys are so yeah. you're just constantly <laughs> adding, right? No, no, it's just actually an just me and Andrew. Just so, the two of you yeah, every day. Yeah, we, we do it every day. We write it together. Andrew directs it. Um, we have lots of friends. We're very lucky. We have friends that come and help out that are in the field. And... Sure, sure. Oh, here, and this is your, your glamorous studio here? Is it the... Now, is that, a, is that a bathroom door to the left, or what is this? What are we seeing here? What is that's, this, Amanda? That, yeah, that's our studio, and that actually just is a little balcony. Yeah. Nice. nice. Very nice. But you, you, you pull it off. I mean, I think that's the beauty of the... the do you consider yourself IPTV? I was going to say that's the beauty of IPTV, um, but... I, I don't consider us TV right. at all, because, you know, we do have links, and we have comments, and we're so interactive. Right. And I know you guys are, too. I was going to say, you know, we do have a chat room. <laughs> <laughs> we never check it, but we have it. Uh, sorry, chatters. They're all sitting there, all crying on their keyboards now. Uh, now, how's the show structured? What do you guys cover? Because, uh, you know, we're a variety potpourri kind of thing. It seems right. like Rocket Boom it can be a little bit of everything as well. It is. It's a little bit of everything. We do kind of focus on Internet culture, you know, web blogs, and... But we also go kind of in the totally opposite route to, you know, politics or just funny things like noodles like we did earlier, sure, sure. you know, um, just kind of like we, what we try to do is do real news that's kind of quirky instead of like SNL where you have, you know, the um, real news to begin with and then the fake punk punchline. Right. And here, here's, the, here's the drummer doing the rim shot. Exactly. Now it's like, no, the story, you can't believe it. We don't even have to make a joke about it. It's absurd. It's, it's just an absurd story, right? right. Now, exactly. I know you said you had a personal vlog and then there's right. Rocket Boom, which is the more the more pro thing. Were, were you a vlogger before this all got started? And what was your start? I wasn't. Um, I... I came in this as an act in, into this as an actress, mm -hmm. so I was, uh, you know, chosen by Andrew, you know, among maybe 500 girls that wanted to do this daily show, and I just thought, wow, wouldn't it be great to do something on film every day? Sure. And to have, you know, just have that experience, and I had no idea it would become this kind of little niche sensation. Right. Uh, well, you, Steve Jobs in the turtleneck right. talking about you on stage, that's a pretty big deal. Uh, I mean. Very big deal. So now, yeah. so now are you totally entrenched in the world oh, that is yeah. blogs I'm, and blogs? I'm, and... I, I, I joke that Andrew's just turned me into this total geek. Like, I'm so entrenched and I'm so, I'm just really into it. He knew, he, he knew when he met me, he wanted a blogger originally, but when sure. he met me, he was like, she's going to get like, into I can, this. I can I Jedi can mind trick her. Yeah. I got her. We're done. Yeah. We're done. So. Well, Amanda, congrats on all the success thank and thank you. you again for stopping by. Thank you, Kevin. All right, visit Rocketboom.com for your daily dose of Amanda. Now